Top story tonight at 11. I think Tristan would be shocked at the dangers of what our great applications meant for fun, meant for communication, and how in the wrong hands they can be used in a way that, that can hurt people. Tomorrow marks three years since the murder of 13-year-old Tristan Bailey. The cheerleader was found stabbed to death in St. Johns County on Mother's Day. And today, their family hosted an event focused on keeping teens safe online. On Your Side's Christina Burgess takes us there. Through informative videos and examples of tactics from predators online, a special agent with Homeland Security Investigations educated an auditorium full of teen girls and their parents on the dangers of social media. It taught me a lot. Rising eighth grade cheerleaders and their parents from all over North Florida are walking out of Tokoy Creek High School with more knowledge on how to keep themselves safe while online. I think it was great for all of us to hear the dangers of social media and how we can protect ourselves from like from everyone and to make sure we're safe online. It made me get like a new perspective on this. A takeaway Tristan Bailey's father, Forrest Bailey, is happy teens are learning and a big reason why the Bailey family held tonight's event. This is really important to us. So it's really not about saying social media is bad and we shouldn't use social media. It's about how we use it responsibly. Homeland Security provided parents with resources and taught them about ways to protect their children, like having your child's passwords or passcodes, knowing your child's friend list, and creating open dialogue with your child. This presentation is the first of its kind held by the Tristan Bailey Foundation, but Tristan Bailey's dad, Forrest Bailey, says that they plan on holding more programs like this one in the future. In St. John's County, Christina Burgess, First Coast News on your side.